we have this majestic view. I want us to be like a nice, yeah. cozy little spot. Now I feel like we're on The Bachelorette. <laughs> I feel like you're about to propose. We have this fun segment on the show that I like to call 3BQs. Okay. That's three big questions. Okay. And I think it might help you if we spoon. I'll be your big spoon. Okay. You be the little spoon. Okay. I'm just gonna come on the I other feel like, side. I feel like I'm in an audition in the early aughts. <laughs> Welcome to my casting couch. Yes. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. Ah! That's actually really nice. Does this feel good? This feels real good. OK, so the first question is easy. What is one of the moments in your life that you felt changed everything, whether it's career hmm. or personal or mm -hmm. what have you? Uh, when my dad died. Mm. Obviously, death is horrible. If you know people have gone through it, they get it. But something in your brain just switches when you lose a loved one or go mm. through a tragedy like that. Everything gets real clear. Like all the things I've been working so hard to do for so long, like get better at saying no, get better at asking for help. As yeah. soon as my dad died, it was like so much easier for me. So yeah. it just it sort of cleared out what was worth worrying about and what wasn't. Yes, that's exactly right. As soon as my dad died, I was like, oh, well, the person whose approval I've been living for isn't here. So I guess I should just do things that I want to do. And I was like, oh, I'm just going to do stand up and like start a podcast and like hang out with animals. That's literally the life you're living. Yeah. Freaking nailed the first question. There's <clears> only <throat> two left. OK, question number two. OK. If you could have truly every person's attention on the planet and they were going to listen to what you were going to say, what would you say to them? Uh, don't eat hard boiled eggs on planes. <laughs> That's what I would use my platform for. I sat next to a woman recently who opened mm -hmm. up a bag of hard boiled eggs. No. I've worked too hard. And we got in a tussle. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you something right now, mm -hmm. I lost. <laughs> I lost the tussle once when she ate them and once when they made their way through her body. Okay, final question. If you could Freaky Friday with any... <laughs> Jamie Lee Curtis, easy. No, if you could Freaky Friday with anyone for a day, who would it be and what would you do? I mean, if I, like, I try to think a little bit too big sometimes. Mm -hmm. Like, my brain is like, I'm gonna be Mark Zuckerberg and go in and just undo all the <laughs> whatever algorithms. Like, yeah. I'd wanna be like the Robin Hood and go in and like be in someone's shoes for a day to like change a bunch of shit, you know? I like you being Zuckerberg, going in and flipping Facebook up. That's what I like. That's I would, cool. I'd want to like go in the day he's testifying and be like, yeah, yep, it's all true. We're taking everyone's data. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm petty as. <laughs> <laughs>